People ask, so what's the difference between scans like SPAC, PET, and MRI? MRI is an anatomy scan. It actually looks at the structure of the brain, how the brain looks, where SPECT and PET look at how the brain functions. SPECT looks at blood flow, PET often looks at glucose metabolism. They're both incredibly helpful to look at function. Um, and SPECT basically tells us three things, good activity, too little or too much, and that way we know how to balance the brain. What are the most common conditions you treat at Amen Clinics with SPECT? The, the most common conditions where SPECT is helpful in diagnosing people is traumatic brain injury, Alzheimer's disease, strokes, resistant psychiatric problems, depression, anxiety, post-traumatic stress disorder, OCD, bipolar disorder. We can often tell what things are by your history, you're depressed, you're anxious, but we can't tell why they are, and you need to know why in order to treat it effectively.